Okay, so we just saw the si the Sephiroth Simon, the Sephiroth Direct. Um, I want to give my my summary on what I think. Um, we're gonna do an actual demonstration of video of this later after I get the chance to play around with the character. Basically, to me, Sephiroth looks like the Belmonts, um, but worse. <laughs> Everybody's going to be so mad at me. And that's that's not factoring in, like, the projectiles and stuff. And I will think he'll have, like, a juggle part that the Belmonts don't necessarily have. But for the most part, I think physically, Sephiroth is Simon Belmont. Let me explain. Pretty much all of the tilt attacks are the same. In fact, I think they all are the same. Forward tilt, up tilt, down tilt, they're pretty much all identical to Simon Belmont. Frame data, hitbox data is still up for debate. I'm just talking about where it looks like the hitboxes land because I don't have the DLC update yet or else I'd be playing that right now. The forward smash specifically intrigues me. It's got super armor, which is awesome, but it's probably going to end up worse. Um, for those of you unaware, I don't know how, Amiibo do not recognize their sweet spots versus their sour spots. They only know that... It exists, okay? The problem we had with the Belmonts was that their forward smash had so much lag to it that they would try to use it, and by the time they got all the way back to here, they would get hit. I think Sephiroth might have the same issue, or at least a similar issue. It's probably not going to be as bad as what the Belmonts had because of the super armor, but it is going to leave him vulnerable, okay? So I'm, I'm not... Um, Sweet Spot's ruined smash attacks, basically. And and this ridiculous amount of, of lag also will. He's really, really light. That's going to hurt him the most. If he was a heavy, that would be different. If he was a heavy, he could live. He's got a pretty good recovery already. Um, so if he was a heavy, then I would say, like, I don't know, maybe B tier. But being light, I don't know how to interpret that. I could really easily see Sephiroth as a glass cannon. Okay? Kind of like Zelda, kind of like Mewtwo. Um... His wing means that the AI is probably going to be a little bit less consistent than it could be. It wouldn't surprise me if there were some bugs and glitches revolving around that. We're not going to find out for a long time. He's got an incredible dash attack. I mean, even better than Hero's dash attack. It blew my mind when I saw that, okay? Um, up tilt and down tilt are the Belmonts. So his up smash is just comedically large. It's just... and his up air are just... Ma I, I think I blinked when the neutral air got shown off, because... Uh, I was trying to find a pen, um, but his his up smash and up air are obviously going to be ridiculously good jugglers. I mean, it's you saw this coming. I didn't predict. I I didn't predict Sephiroth would be the king of the juggle meta, but if that thing ever happens, oh lordy. Um, back air seems like it'll be pretty good. It seems like a one hit version of Mega Man's back air, in that it'll come out quickly and be good for KOs, and it not it's not going to be that intuitive. You know what I mean? Up air to up smash, definitely, or up air and up smash, sorry, um, differentiates him from the Belmonts, okay? That's the difference between the two of them. Wouldn't surprise me if a forward tilt spam Sephiroth ended up being optimal, um, but up air and up smash are his unique features from the Belmonts, okay? Um, his neutral special reminds me of Hero and Robin's neutral special, but the difference is that with Hero and Robin, um, although they're very similar, you can hold the charge, and Sakurai never held the charge with Sephiroth. So we might actually see... And I, I feel like there's a neutral special out there that is is basically identical to Sephiroth in that it's like three attacks in one, and the longer you hold it, the long, you know, the longer it'll take to go off. Um, and different attacks happen, but you can't hold it. And I can't remember what it is for the life of me. I'm really trying to remember it, and I just don't know. Because um, that's, that's the difference between Hero and Robin's a neutral special and presumably Sephiroth is that with Hero and Robin you can and Samus's for example you can hold it all the way and then store a charge of the the final version and with Sephiroth it doesn't look like that's the case probably the biggest um the the biggest and most unusual thing that I saw with his character was actually Shadow Flare I, I wouldn't be surprised if Shadow Flare was like a corrupting force um, it seems like it forces shields. Like, if, if the Amiibo AI knows that an attack is coming, it's going to try and shield it, right? So it wouldn't surprise me at all if it if you could just Shadow Flare your opponent and they just go crazy because they see impending attack hitboxes, or maybe they don't, and, and they just get hit out of the blue or something like that, you know? Um, this It reminds me of Mega Man's side special, the, the Gooey Bomb. Or whatever I think actually I think that's the name of a move in or an item in Brawl. Um, but Mega Man's side special reminds me. Um, 
whenever amiibo get hit with it, they suddenly get really erratic. Because they're like, oh shit, impending hitboxes, impending hitboxes, impending hit. what am I going to do? And then when it actually explodes, they'll shield it maybe. But that that's basically setting up, you know, for a perfect kill. So that side special, very interesting to me. Um, I don't know if the amiibo would ever be able to use it properly, but it, very interesting to me. Um, down special spam might be really good. Um, oh, oh, the up special. Um, so the up special... Uh, wouldn't surprise me since it's it's a multi-hit and it moves it's basically falcon kick if it had eight powerful attacks right if he could use that on the ground like as an actual attack attack that would be really good i could see that being incredibly effective and useful um down special spam might be really good i don't think it would be um i actually don't see much of a use for down special spam unless he can use it reactively just like all other counters that's that's how that is um the cave if the cave doesn't transform then that should be legal basically um I, I don't see a problem with legalizing that at all. It's basically Kalos, but, like, cooler looking. So, sure, we'll have a counter pick for Kalos. Who cares? Anyway. Nice. <laughs> My initial gut thoughts on Sephiroth. I'm going to try and get this thing downloaded so we can get some videos up of, of Sephiroth tonight. Woo! Stay tuned.